This is breaking news from Channel 13 Eyewitness News. We have news. nobody in, in custody at this time. Uh, so as far as I'm concerned, yes, there is somebody out there that did this horrendous crime. And uh, we're going to track them down. And state police talking about the fear and concern in a small town community after they announced that two missing girls were in fact victims of murder. Investigators solemnly identified the two bodies found in Carroll County as 13-year-olds Libby German and Abby Williams. Now, we still don't know what happened to them after they disappeared during an afternoon hiking trip. Eyewitness News reporter Rich Van Wyk begins our team coverage tonight first with an update on the investigation. Rich? And Marie, the autopsies confirmed identities, but how these children were killed, the circumstances surrounding their death, police aren't talking about that. They say they don't want to say anything that could jeopardize this double homicide investigation. For the second day, local, state, and federal investigators scoured over the crime scene. Early afternoon, divers joined the search for clues that could lead detectives to the girl's killer. The autopsies confirmed what everyone, including the teen's families, suspected and feared. I think they were in pretty much belief that it was their, their children. Um, but when you hear it from an official, it, it's, it's still a little just, still it hits home twice. One of the hundreds of volunteer searchers found the bodies of Libby German and Abby Williams in a wooded area near Deer Creek. It is an area accessible only by foot or on horse. Well off the popular trails, the 13-year-olds were hiking. Dozens of police are now checking hundreds of leads. We are using resources from uh, all the way from Lowell, Fort Wayne, and uh, the southern state or the southern part of the state's uh, police state troopers. We will stay on the job until it is done. Police say they have no suspects or persons of interest. They're asking anyone who was in the hiking area who saw something or heard something or took any pictures contact them. Should people in this community be concerned about someone running around targeting kids? My response is, is no. I feel safe for this community. Libby and Abby, teens teachers describe as happy and go lucky, attended Delphi's Middle School. Crisis teams were ready for students and teachers when they arrived at all the district schools. They're just asking those questions right now of, oh my gosh, you hit me, and somebody's there for them. The double homicide has prompted one of the largest investigations some officers say they've ever been part of. As far as I'm concerned, yes, there is somebody out there that did this horrendous crime, and uh, we're going to track them down. Also, police say there is someone out there who probably saw something, was on the trails, was driving that part of the country just east of Delphi. They may have seen someone. They may have seen a car that perhaps looked out of place, and that's why police want that person to call them. Back to you.